which way he went. Ah! Oh, there he is. There he is. Sephiroth said to me, head north past the snowfields. Come on, let's fight him. Let's fight him. Look at this snowy city. What an interesting little, little place this is. Ah, play the video. Yes. The original crisis. What is weapon? Confidential. We're going to be cheeky. We're going to go straight for the confidential. <laughs> Daughter's record, 10 day after birth. Daughter's record, 20 day after birth. <gasps> oh, wait, she's watching a video. What are you doing, Professor? I mean, honey. Oh, I'm thinking of taping it on video, but the video is not working right. What are you going to tape? Is there still something I haven't mentioned? No, that's not it. I'm going to record my beautiful daughter. And when she's sleeping, her face looks like an angel. I've already decided... <gasps> Ay, 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 ay. I've already decided if it's a girl, then it'll be Aerith. That's that. Right, oh, the videotape. Oh my god! 20 days! What happened 20 days after birth? Is this Aerith's real mum? Dear again, you just got through taping. Aerith's mum is so pretty. Please don't say it that way. It's our lovely daughter, both yours and mine. Don't you want to capture her childhood on videotape? I will protect you and Aerith no matter what. You and Aerith are my only treasures. I'll never let you go. I feel so much better now, darling. Oh, no, that hug is too cute. How dare they intrude um, on, my, on our private time together. I'll send them away. It, it's them. Heh <laughs> heh I've been searching for you, uh, Ifauna. Or should I say, Cetra. Long time no see, Professor Ghost. Wait! 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 Hojo, how did you know? Two years I waited, that's how much I wanted this new sample. Wait! Hang on! Hojo is gonna do something that I don't wanna- I don't wanna know just yet. But Professor Ghost, who we haven't seen before, who I have heard about a few times in this game, is Aerith's dad. I don't know. I don't know! Ah, oh, okay, let's continue. A new sample. You don't mean Aerith. Hmm, Aerith, what a nice name. Ha ha ha. That's it. I am severing all ties with the Shinra. Hojo, please leave. Fauna, please. Aerith has nothing to do with it. All you want is me, right? I need all of you for my experiment. You understand, don't you, Professor Ghost? We can change the future of the planet. Don't worry, Fauna. I'll take care of this. Please don't put up a fight. I don't want to harm. I don't want any harm to come to my precious sample. Hmm, what a funny looking camera guard. Destroy it. Be careful with her. I found her. Take Aerith and run. Darling! Oh, and uh, don't forget the child. And the video. The Ancients. Weapon. What the heck? Hojo been causing trouble for time. I found her. Can you comment on the thing called Weapon? Yes, Professor. The one the Professor mistook for, etc. was named Genova. That is the crisis from the sky. The planet knew um, it had to destroy the crisis from the sky. You see, as long as Genova exists, the planet will never be able to fully heal itself. Back then, weapon was a weapon. A planet produced by its own will? Yes, but there is no record of weapon ever being used. A small number of the surviving Cetra defeated Genova and confined it. The planet produced weapon, but, is, but it was no longer necessary to use it. So weapon no longer exists on this planet. Weapon cannot vanish. It remains asleep somewhere on the planet. Even though Genova is confined, it could come back to life at some time. The planet has not fully healed itself yet. It's keeping watch on Genova. Where is Weapon? I don't know. I can't hear the voice of the planet as well. Times have changed. The planet is probably watching this situation closely. Thank you, Athalna. That would be all for today. Ooh. The original crisis. Camera's ready. Then Ifauna, please tell us about the Cetra. 2,000 years ago, our ancestors, the Cetra, heard the cries of the planet. The first ones to discover the planet's uh, wound were the Cetra at the Knoll's Pole. Tell us, Ifauna, where is the land called Knoll's Pole? Knoll's Pole refers to this area. The Cetra then began a planet reading. Ifauna, what exactly does a planet reading entail? I can't explain it very well. But it's like having a, a conversation with the planet. It is said something fell from the sky, making a large wound. Thousands of Cetra pulled together trying to heal the planet. But due to the severity of the wound, it was only able to heal itself over many years. Do the ancients, rather the Cetra, have special powers to heal the planet? No, it's not that kind of power. 
The life force of all living things on this planet becomes the energy. Hesetra tried desperately to cultivate the land so as not to diminish the needed energy. Hmm. Even so close to the North Cave, the snow never melts. Is that because the planet's energy is gathered here to heal its injury? Yes. The energy that was needed to heal the planet withered away the land. Then the planet... The planet tried to persuade the Cetra to leave the Knoll's Pole, but... Let's take a break. I'm alright. When the Cetra were preparing to part with the land they loved, that's when it appeared. It looked like our, our dead mothers and our dead brothers showing our spectres of their past. Who is the person that appeared at the North Cave? I haven't any idea. That's when the one who injured the planet, or the crisis from the sky, as we call it, came. It first approached as a friend, deceived them, and finally gave them the virus. The Cetra were attacked by the virus and went mad, transforming into monsters. Then just as it, then just as it had at the Noel's Pole, it approached other Cetra clans and infected them with the virus. You don't look well, let's call it a day. That's so much to take in right now. Oh, what is going on here? What is this shiny thing? Can I take it? Oh, look at all the cats. Look at all the cats. My boy got hurt right about the time we moved here. I never should get got him that snowboard. Oh, no, don't. There's a steep grade past here. It's dangerous, please don't go. Thanks for your kindness. No, no, I just did what came natural. I guess I'm not too busy now. Do you want to learn how to ride a snowboard? Maybe I should. Oh, God, okay. Oh? That's Eleanor, right? There they are. Hurry. I won't let you go any further. What's down there? It's a secret. You mean Boss Song? That wasn't us. Sephiroth did it. No, liar. Don't think you can fool me. Looks like we're just... Looks like just talking won't do. You're gonna have to feel some pain. Just you and me. No, I can handle him. There's no way he can avoid my punch. What? Yeah. I tried! I tried to punch! I dodge, I mean. <laughs> I tried to dodge! I got hurt on my snowboard, and now I can't go out for a while. Hey, I'll give you my snowboard. I'll take it. We clearly need it. Alright, we got a snowboard. Sorry I ran up a while ago. I thought there was going to be trouble. Anyhow, you'll need a snowboard to get down that hill. Want to learn how to ride one? Okay, let's have a look. Uh-oh. Snowboarding. Is that material? No, a balloon. And we've got to get the balloons, okay. Ah! 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 Snowmen! Oh, I missed the other balloon. I missed it. 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 Ah! <laughs> oh, did you see that jump though? I went from can't do it to pro snowboarder in a minute of seconds. And now here we go. Failure once again. <laughs> oh, look at the- Stop it, Moogle snowmen. Stop it. That's amazing. That's amazing. Do you want to build a snowman? Come on, let's go and play. You get that song in my head now. I never see you anymore. Go out the door. It's like you've gone away. Oh my god, is that snow snow bros? Snow choker bros? Choker snows? Snow chokes? Choker choker snow bros? Love it. Bye cloud! It sure is cold. We'll freeze if we stay here any longer. All right, we got to get out of here then, don't we? Oh, cloud! Look at cloud go! <laughs> Ayo? You collapsed at the Great Glacier. It's a miracle you're alive. We were looking for you! Holes off. We were looking for you. Okay, we found you. Amazing. My name is Holes off. Um, I've been living here 20 years now. If you're planning to head north, you better listen to me. You ever hear about those who challenged the cliff? No. There's an old legend that says something fell from the sky here a long time ago. It's supposed to have pushed the land up and formed this cliff. 20 years ago, Yamski and I braved this cliff to see what was on the other side. But we weren't prepared for it. 
We never dreamed the temperature would be so low. That cliff has a biting cold wind that lowers your body temperature. Yamsky was below me. He cut his own rope. I didn't even notice. I've lived here ever since, challenging the cliff and providing warning and shelter to my fellow climbers. If you're going to climb the cliff, you need to take two precautions. First, check your route. It's hard to find because of all the snow. You must be tired coming all the way up here. Better get some rest before you head out. You know what I've been thinking? What is it? Seeing a place like this makes you realize how awesome nature is. But if anyone ever told me to live here, I'd tell them to, well, you know. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing though, if I did have to live here, I'd change things around and make it better. I guess Midgar is the total opposite of this place. When you think of it that way, the Shimra doesn't seem too bad. What the hell am I saying? The Shimra? Not bad? We'll secure the route. You come up later. Jump down to the room below. Oh. D -d -d oh, it's this music. Okay, I like this music. Yay. Yay. <gasps> Two headed dinosaur? Okay. <laughs> Bahamut! Bahamut! <laughs> you go die. Great. Ba -ba -da -da. <gasps> Don't you dare. Huh? So wait, did we win, but then because we died? Who died first? I saw the dinosaurs. Who died first? <laughs> Vincent's also surviving quite well, you know. This might be it. This might be it. <laughs> do, do, do. <laughs> do I just attack Tifa? Please don't tell me I attack Tifa then. <gasps> yeah! An old crater. Something fell out of the sky and crashed down here, leaving a scar on the planet. It's a massive, vast amount of energy to heal itself. Sephiroth took that energy and it's trying to use the meteor. Next time the wound won't be so small. Back to Sephiroth. Oh? You're going after Sephiroth, aren't you? I've lost a lot because of Sephiroth. Let's go. That's... <gasps> oh, Shinra. Shinra, Shinra. So I finally found you. This is the promised land the president has been searching for. But I'll be the one who gets it. That land is no one's. It's where the reunion will take place. They will all gather here. I wonder if we'll see Sephiroth. All right, I see him. This is the end for all of you. Ayo! Sephiroth! Sephiroth is just evil, just absolutely evil. This is the end. You're right, this is the end of this body's usefulness. What do you mean? He disappeared? He might still be nearby. Our purpose is to deliver the black materia to our master. Ow! Stay on alert, you never know when Sephiroth might appear. Those who carry Genova cells. Master? 
Of course, Sephiroth. Oh <gasps> <gasps> my god, that scared me! Oh jeez, oh my health is really low as well. No, I meant to do that for T for Dota Vincent, I meant to do that for Vincent. Nova cells. Hmm. So that's what this is all about. The Genova reunion. Not Sephiroth? You mean all this time? It wasn't Sephiroth we've been after? I'll explain later. Right now, the only thing I'm thinking about is beating Sephiroth. What do you mean it wasn't about Sephiroth all this time? What do you mean? But Sephiroth is... He's here. The real Sephiroth is just beyond here. It's both incredibly wicked and cruel. But it's realising a powerfully strong will from deep within the planet's wound. The black materia is back in our hands. Now all we have to do is defeat Sephiroth and that'll be the end of it. You better not take the black materia any further. Why don't you give it to someone else on to hold on to? I'm gonna give it to Red. You want me to take the black materia? Alright, I understand. Don't give it to anyone. I'm counting on you. Alright, Red. Red's got the black materia. Do you know what? I, do you know what? I feel like I should have given it to Yuffie now, just for lols. Let's find Sephiroth. We're going in first. You guys stay and keep watch. What is this? What happened? Calm down, Tifa. Sephiroth is near. Anything can happen. Nibbleheim? Nibbleheim. Nibbleheim is like the cutest name. <laughs> this is an illusion Sephiroth made up. He's trying to confuse us. It'll be alright. As long as we know it's an illusion, there's nothing to be afraid of. Look! Oh. Alright, let's go. That's not Cloud. Who is this man? Stop, Sephiroth. This is so stupid. Was Sephiroth dubbing? <laughs> Was Sephiroth dubbing? <laughs> Cloud, it's just an illusion. What's next? Stop it already. All this happened while I slept. This is what actually happened five years ago. But... It's probably not me that will come out of the Shimmer Mansion. He's going to try and show us another stupid illusion. Oh my god, it's him. See? Didn't I tell you? Zangon. Hey, it's you. You're still sane, right? I don't want to watch this. Cloud, don't watch. I'll check this house. You check that one over there. What's wrong, Tifa? I told you before, right? As long as we know um, that it's just an illusion, there's no need to be scared. Are you alright? Hmm, it was an illusion. Sephiroth, I know you're listening. I know what you want to say. That I wasn't in Nibbleheim five years- I think I'm getting it. That's it, isn't it? <gasps> I see, you finally understand. What are you trying to say is that you want to confuse me, right? But even making me see those things won't affect me. I remember it all. The heat of the fire, the pain in my body, and in my heart. Oh, is that so? You are just a puppet. You have no heart. I cannot feel any pain. How could there be any meaning in the memory of such a being? What I have shown you is reality. What you remember, that is the illusion. But I want to ask you one thing. Why? Why are you doing this? Ha ha ha. I want to take you back to your real self. The one who gave me the black materia that day. Who would ever thought a failed experiment would prove so useful? Hojo would die if he knew. Hojo? What does he have to do with me? Five years ago you were... 
constructed by Hojo piece by piece right after Nibelheim was burned. A puppet made of vibrant Genova cells, a knowledge and the power of the Mako. An incomplete Sephiroth clone, not, e not even given a number. That is your reality. But is he telling the truth though? What do I do? Cloud. Cloud, don't listen to him. What's wrong, Tifa? I'm not affected by it. I wasn't paying attention to him. All that talk of Hojo constructing you is a lie. Don't we have our memories together? I was just about to ask that. Being kids together, starlit nights. Ha ha ha, Tifa. Why are you so worried and scared by those words? Hmm. Shall I show everyone here what's in your heart? Aha, you don't look well. Tifa, is Sephiroth right? Cloud, why are you so scared? Don't worry about me, I'm alright. No matter how confused I am, I'll never believe a word that Sephiroth says. It's true that sometimes I can't figure out who I am. There's a lot of things modelled up in my memories. But Tifa, you said long time no see, Cloud, right? Those words will always support me. I am the one you grew up with. I am Cloud of Nibelheim. No matter how much I lose faith in myself, that is the truth. That's why you shouldn't be so scared. No matter what anyone else says to me, it's your opinion that counts. No, that's not true, Cloud. What's not? I'm the same Cloud you grew up with, aren't I? That's not what I mean. I don't know how to say it. Cloud, I need some time. Just give me a little time. Ayo? Hey, Cloud, don't blame Tifa. The ability to change one's looks, voice, and words is the power of Genova. Inside you, Genova has merged with Tifa's memories, creating you. Huh? Out of Tifa's memory, a boy named Cloud might have just been a part of them. Cloud? Please don't think right now. Haha, <laughs> think, Cloud. Haha, <laughs> oh excuse me, you never had a name. Shut up, Sephiroth. Do you remember the picture that we took before we headed for Mount Nibble? Tifa, you remember, right? Now, what happened to that picture? Do you want to see it? It turned out pretty good. Cloud, don't. I should be in the picture. Even if I'm not in there, no worry. This is just an illusionary world of Sephiroth made up. my god oh my god oh my bloody god i think i get it i think i get it this is actually shocking i would not in a million years of guess that <laughs> just as i thought his pictures are fake the truth is in my memory five years ago i came back to nibbleheim to inspect the reactor i was 16. the town hadn't changed at all what did i do oh yeah I saw my mum. I saw the people in town. Yeah, I went to Tifa's room. There I... I played the piano. I spent the night and went to the reactor in Mount Nibble. I was excited about it. Because that was my first mission after becoming first class in Soldier. Soldier, first class. Soldier? When did I enter Soldier? How did I join Soldier? Oh, God. Why, why can't I remember? I didn't have to worry about it because I was... Cloud? Let's go, Tifa. I'm... I'm alright. I feel so sorry for Cloud. I feel so sorry for Cloud. Cloud is a puppet, obviously. Cloud is basically... Shion from Kingdom Hearts. That's that's where my mind is at. Cloud is literally basically Shion. And Sephiroth is completely right. Like he was constructed by Hojo using cells from Genova. And he has Tifa's memories. What I don't understand is the Zack connection. But we'll I will obviously understand that either later on in this game or I will understand that more in Crisis Core. I, I, I know that's going to happen. But in some sort of way, it feels like Cloud is like a replica of Zack to a degree. Because even Cloud, even Aerith said that 
they're just they're very similar or they're almost the same or something even Erif said that and then Tifa has but then why is Tifa having memories of Cloud though she, I mean she got be under some sort of thing going on but Tifa actually had the memories with Zack. <gasps> Which means if Tifa had the memories with Zack really and it wasn't Cloud, then Tifa must have been in love with Zack this whole time. So there's actually a Tifa Zack ship going on. What the f <laughs> No. Wow, that's amazing. It's all material. The outside is rich with Mako energy. The inside is a treasure trove of material. The truly this truly is the, uh, of the promised land. There is no such thing as the promised land. It's a legend, an old wives' tale. It's utterly ridiculous. Everything's as I imagined it to be. Isn't it splendid? Is it that kind of dullness that makes you a second-rate scientist? What's happening? It's coming from within the wall. Something's in there. It's moving. Weapon. A monster created by the planet. They appear when a planet's in danger and destroys everything. That's what was stated in Professor Garth's report. I never saw that report. Where is it? Here. Right here. <gasps> the eye, I saw it, I saw the eye. I wonder how Cloud and the others are. It's hard to believe such a small piece of material could destroy the planet. <gasps> what the? Is everyone all right? Red, what's going on? Nanaki, where am I? Don't leave me alone. I'm so glad. Tifa, something is strange. Why was it all dark and all of a sudden? And where is everybody? Everyone's waiting, Cloud's in trouble. Please come help us. He he he. And remember. The black material. Sephiroth, you absolute cheeky, cheeky, cheeky. Mr. President, I've got a bad feeling about this place. Hmm, maybe we should go back to our ship now. We need to prepare for the inspection anyway. Hey, where did you come from? Don't know. This place is going to get rough. Better leave things to me and get out of here while you still can. Leave things to you? Hmm, I don't know what you mean. This is where the reunion is happening, where everything begins and ends. Cloud, I'm here. I'm here to help you, Cloud. Oh, Cloud. Look at him. I feel so sorry for him. Thanks, Ref13. Where's the black material? It's safe. I'm holding on to it. I'll take it from here. Give me the black material. You can't hear my voice? Are you all right, Cloud? Then here you go. I was a little apprehensive holding this thing. No, don't. Stop, Cloud. Thanks, leave the rest to me. Oh, what the hell happened there? Everyone thanks for everything and I'm sorry. Especially you, Tifa. I'm really sorry. You've been so good to me, I don't know what to say. I never lived up to being Cloud. Maybe one day you'll meet the real Cloud. Ha ha ha, this is perfect. It means that my experiment was a complete success. What number were you? Huh? Where is your tattoo? Professor Hojo, I don't have a number. You didn't give me one because you said I was a failed experiment. What the? You mean only a failure made it here? Professor, please give me a number. Please, Professor. Shut up, miserable failure. <gasps> Who was that? The Sephiroth clone I created after the real Sephiroth died five years ago? Genova Cells and Mako, with my knowledge and skills, have been combined with science and nature to bring him to life. I'm not wild about the failure part, but the Genova reunion theory has now been proven. You see, even if Genova's body is dis disem disembered, it will eventually become one again. That's what it is meant by Genova's reunion. I have been waiting for the reunion to start five years have passed, and now the clones have begun to return. I thought the clones would begin to gather at Midgar, where Genova is stored, but my predictions were not entirely correct. Genova itself began to move away from the Shinra building. But being the genius that I am, I soon figured it out. You see, it was all Sephiroth's doing. Sephiroth is not just content to diffuse his will into the life stream. He wants to manipulate the clones himself. Yes, that's that was how it got started. I wondered where the clones were going, but I was never able to figure it out. I couldn't figure it out either. The one thing that I did know was that Sephiroth was at their final destination. I wasn't pursuing Sephiroth. I was being summoned by Sephiroth. All the anger and hatred I bore him made it impossible for me to even forget him. That and what he gave me. Sephiroth? Sephiroth, I'm here, and I brought you the black material. Show yourself to me. Where are you? So we finally meet again. <gasps> Oh my god. Did 
Did you see it? It's Sephiroth. So he is here. This is perfect. Hope Genova's reunion and Sephiroth's will. They won't be diffused into the live stream. They're gathered here. Cloud has the black materia. Sephiroth is going to summon Meteor. Every single person is going to die. Whatever I say now is too little, too late. We must evacuate. I want you all to come with me. There's still so much more I want to know. Cloud, no, stop, please. Cloud. <gasps> oh my god. No. Oh my god, this is scary. This is really scary. My goodness. What is going on? What is going on? Cloud, I didn't know what to do. I was always like that. This is a flashback, isn't it? What's the matter? Oh, poor kid. Oh, are you all right? Uh, uh, Tifa. Tifa? Oh, Cloud. That's right, I'm Cloud. Is it really you, Cloud? I never thought I'd find you here. Yeah, it's been a while. What happened to you? You don't look well. Yeah, it's nothing. I'm okay. How long has it been? Five years. It's really been a long time. Actually, it's been seven years. You joined Soldier, but quit after the Sephiroth incident. And now you're a mercenary. You told me a lot about what happened after you left Nibelheim. But something was wrong. I felt there was something strange about the things you talked about. All the things that you didn't know that you should and other things. And you should, shouldn't know that they did. And that's why I told you about the avalanche job. I wanted to be with you and watch you. The glare. You'll be better soon. You've been asleep for a long time. I'm hungry. Hey, why don't you ask about him? Because I'm scared. Don't worry. I don't know what happened to Cloud either. Guess I shouldn't tell you not to worry. None of them know if he's alright either. He's still alive, right? What about Sephiroth? You ain't over it yet. Remember that huge light in a northern cave? Since then, the crate has been surrounded by a huge barrier of light. Everyone knows Sephiroth sleeps in that big hole, protected by the barrier. We can't do a damn thing about it. We just gotta wait till he wakes up. And on top of that, some huge monster called Weapon's been on a rampage. Hey, how about Meteor? Oh, we're Tifa now! Ooh, this is crazy! I thought Cloud would show up to save you all. Professor Hojo wanted to check up on, on Cloud too. Meteor has been summoned. Essentially, it's all, over, all but over now. Execution? What are you going to get by executing us? You are to be executed for causing this situation. You are ignorant. They'll feel better as long as someone is punished. I take back what little praise I had for this damn jackass. Well, enjoy your last moments together. No! Is everyone here? Um, these are the ones who brought this madness into the world. The hell are these people? You'll be broadcasting your miserable death song <gasps> live on national television. Gotta do it. Take me first. What are you doing? This is my special gas chamber. Take your time and enjoy a slow, painful death. 
Scarlet. Well, now the show is about to begin. Kia ha ha. Emergency! Emergency! Weapons approaching. Attention all. Military personnel, take your positions. Oh no, it's weapon. Run! Hey, all of you! Damn, why now? How does it feel now, Scarlet? Hmm, so you didn't run. I'm impressed. How do I feel right now? Sleeping gas? Kate Sif? Let's just say I'm against capital punishment. Besides, I hate this broad. Come on, we've got to help Tifa. I'll keep watch at the entrance. Weapon approaching! It's heading right towards us. Speed 50 knots. It can't be. We hit it dead on. How about the cannon? It'll take time to reload. And use regular firepower in the meantime. Oh. <gasps> Guys, it's weapon! Oh my god. Do, 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 do. Look at weapon. Weapon is scary. <gasps> Gas. No, Tifa. Oh my god. Yay, we did it. Which button stopped the gas? What button stops the gas? Oh, I'm trying to activate it. Hey, we did it! Okay, cool. Won't open. Oh god, weapon. Oh my god, weapon is so scary. Whoa, we just shot his, we just beheaded weapon. We just shot his head off. Sam, what did you do? Hey, open it. First you locked me in this weird place and now you're telling me to come out? Make your mind up. Oh God. Oh, the eeriness of this though right now. Our little game of hide and seek ends here. This execution may have been unsuccessful, but your death by falling and crashing into the wall below might still be pretty exciting. <gasps> Damn! Run to the end of the cannon. Tifa, let's go. Oh, I love it so much. Da, 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 da. Oh, I love it. Made it. The gang is together. You okay? My cheeks hurt a bit. Forget it. What's all this about? Well, I'll catch the details later. In any case, the airship high wind is now yours. Damn it! Why didn't you tell me you could fly an airship? I thought Tifa was gone for good. Everyone? Everyone's here? That's it! I see Nanaki as well. Welcome to my airship, the High Wind. What's wrong? You should be more excited than that. Sid, not enough crew. So glad you're all right, Tifa. Do you think we aren't as strong enough without Cloud? Do you think we can save the planet alone? Oh, Meteor is coming, and Weapon is on the rampage. At a time like this, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Get a hold of yourself, Tifa. Come on, let's think about this. No way can we get off a train we're on. If only Cloud was here, everything would be fine. Cloud would stand that, stand that cocky little way he did and tell us what to do. I'm sorry, Barrett. I'm so depressed. I'm surprised at myself. And Tifa, the reason why we all thought it was Cloud was because... I know. That's why I want to make sure... That's why I have to see him again. If we can find out where he is, the high wind will get us there in no time. Cloud is still stuck deep in the north crater. 
where the ground cracked and swallowed him up, buried in the depths of the underground, deep within the earth. Are you talking about the life stream? The life stream sometimes gushes out from cracks in the ocean floor to the surface. I heard about such a place. All right, there we go. Oh, it's funky music. Chocobo racing. <laughs> yeah, chocobo music. You're joking. Work, 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 work. Oh, it's amazing. <laughs> Everyone's panicking. Chocobos are all humans who don't look like they give them greens. What's the matter? Are you all alone? Oh, I heard the dog. You got lost, didn't you? Separate from someone you love, silly thing. I guess it's been about a week now since he washed up here on the shore. Poor pokey-headed young thing. It was really sad but weird. He was holding this really long sword. I don't know. The whole thing feels unlucky to me, but the amazing thing was those weird blue eyes. What? Wait a minute, what did you just say? Excuse me, that person you were just talking about? Yeah, a villager found him a little ways down the coast. It was about a week ago, I think. Poor kid. He must have drifted from somewhere pretty far away. Cloud! It must be! It's Cloud! Bingo. You found him. So where is he? Is he safe? Where is he now? Yeah, up ahead here. At the, uh, clinic. Cloud? Hey, you barged in here like Meteor was crashing down or something. I'm sorry, but I heard a friend of mine was here. Oh, that young fellow. He's next door, but his condition isn't good. Cloud? Oh, is it Cloud? Oh, Cloud, I'm so glad you're safe. That's heartbreaking. What's wrong, Cloud? Marco poisoned him. Quite an advanced case. It appears this young man's been exposed to high levels of Mako energy for an extended period of time. He probably has no idea who or where he is now. Poor fellow, he can't even speak. He's literally miles away from us. Some place far away where no one's ever been all alone. You lying or what? Ahem, let's excuse ourselves. Listen, would you all mind waiting outside? Why? What do you want me to do? Please, Cloud, talk to me. Tell me you see me. That you can hear me. Tell me, please. I made it this far believing in the memories we shared. This isn't happening. It's too cruel. Hey, Doc, is he gonna... Is he okay? Is he gonna heal? I'll say it again. He's got Mako poison him. I've never seen a case this bad. An immense amount of Mako drenched knowledge was infused into his brain. It's a miracle he survived. No normal human could have. Yeah, that's right. Besides, we're here for him. He's gotta get better. I don't care about anything else, only Cloud. I want to be by his side, and you gotta do it. You gotta be true to yourself. I'm so sorry everyone, especially now. No big, no big. I'll pop in again later. What do now? What can we do? Huh? Ain't there nothing we can do? And don't go telling us to wait for Cloud to get better. Well, I've got some news. Both Gaia and Kaiaha are up to something. Want to eavesdrop? Oh, there's so much story that keeps happening. Now then, we're faced with two issues. One, destroy Meteor. Two, remove the barrier around North Cave and defeat Sephiroth. Any ideas? The first problem's already solved. Meteor will soon be smashed to bits. The plan is already in motion. We're collecting huge materia from each region. What? Huge materia is high density special type of materia made through a special compression process in macro reactors. The energy extracted from it, it it's 330 times the strength of normal materia. We will gather all the huge materia together and ram it into Meteor. That will cause a huge explosion, reducing Meteor literally to bits. You're going to ram Meteor? Do you think we have the technology to do it? First things first. Right now, we've got to collect huge materia from each area. We've already collected materia from Nibelheim. All that's left are Corel and Fort Condor. I've already dispatched troops to Corel. What else can I do to Corel? And the huge materia. You mean the huge materia, don't you? I've heard about it. When our small materia nears the larger one, there should be some reaction. I'm certain of it. That's why we're using the materia power in our fight. Can't let Shimra get hold of the huge materia. Besides, when Cloud gets back, I want to show him this huge materia. He's going to be so shocked. So what are you saying, Barrett? Even though you were always uh, knocking him, you really want Cloud to return. I ain't saying nothing about nothing, so just shut your face. <laughs> Everyone's group's got to have a leader. What? What's going on? You've been chosen to be the new leader. <laughs> Pain in the ass. Forget it. 
But for us to fight, we gotta have high wind. And you, we need to save the planet. And who's running this ship? You. That's why you are our new leader. Ain't no, ain't no one else can do it. Hmm, this ship's gonna save the planet, huh? Ain't that gonna be a, just a little tough? Oh man, stab me in the heart. All right, now here's the first job. The operation room's waiting for you. Oh, now it's Sid. When you're ready, we're heading for the core reactor. Come on, leader man, let's hurry. There we go. Oh, you guys are... Guess we're safe for now. Oh, well wait. Oh, what is this? Uh, looks like they're taking off with the huge materia in that train. <gasps> now we've got to get up. Did the Shimmer beat us? What are you going to do? Huge materia. Hey, do you know who I am? I'm Sid, that's who the hell I am. Now just let me handle it. Go on, Sid. Are we driving? It sure helped having Sid here. I had no idea he could drive a train. Don't worry, I can handle this. Two levers, one on the right and one on the left. Pull the lever, crunk. I see, just alternate the two levers up and down, right? Judging from the enemy speed, I'd say it'll take about 10 minutes. We're gonna fly, hold on tight. Oh no. These are weird controls for this. Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! Come on, speed up, 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 speed up. I'm doing it. <laughs> How much time was on that? How much time was on that? Oh my god. <laughs> Seconds? Aren't you the ones that stopped the Shimra train? The Shimra was just about to destroy our lives again. To hell with Meteor. We're coal miners, aren't, ain't we? We'll dig a deep tunnel and hide from the Meteor. Hey kid, how about giving something to the, these guys fighting the Shimra? I got it out of the well. Isn't it amazing? Isn't it an amazing rock? Received ultimate material. There we go. We love the high wind. We did it. Do, do. Oh, it's so pretty. This one is so pretty. You've come at a good time. Shimmer's changing its strategy now. It seems that Shimmer will destroy the reactor and then take out the material that's inside. We can't afford to be beaten. If we lose here, all the material we gathered will be for nothing. Damn, I guess we have to protect this area too. Yes, we did it. That was wonderful. Thank you. I doubt Shimmer will attack now. Ah, Oh, bird. Oh! What happened to the bird? That light just now. Oh my god, I hope the bird's okay. That light just now, the condor, the egg. What? Would you go outside and see what it was? <gasps> it's a big bird. Gone. Be sure and report to my father too. Okay, so your father is down here, correct? Everyone thanks, I really mean it, thanks. Although there isn't anything we can give you, we'll make sure you can stop in and stay any time, so be sure to drop by. Yes, yes, and there's one thing I forgot to tell you. Ooh, huge materia. Huh? What's this? Gotta have that materia. The truth is, this is the materia inside the reactor. What the hell did we fight for? We weren't protecting the reactor, we were protecting the condor. When a reactor was built, um, they forced us to help. That's how we knew what was inside the reactor. I knew this day would come, so after the Shimmer left, I sneaked in and took the material. I didn't mean to fool you, but I guess that's how it ended up. I'm really sorry. Just forget about it. Anyway, we're still alive. I see. If you put it that way, we're really grateful. So the last uh, huge materia that Shimmer's after is in the underwater reactor in Junon. We must get there before them and stop them. How about we take a break and go see that little fella for a bit? You mean Cloud? Yeah, I'm worried about Tifa. She may have collapsed taking care of the guy. How about checking in on him down to Middell? Yeah, very creepy music. And then you go into like funky music. Yeah, I love it. Ahoy, this here's Middell, a quite hot springs town. At least it used to be. 
Lately, the sea's been in a tizzy. Livestream has been mixing things up at the bottom of the ocean. I hate seeing cloud like this. I hate it. It's no use. I don't understand a thing. Cloud. What should I do? What if you never recover for the rest of your life? Ah! Coming. They're coming. What did you say, Cloud? Ah! Uh... Damn, what the hell's going on? Ah! Oh, guys! What's this? The live stream is gushing up from below the surface of the earth. Damn, that's... This is bad. Sid, what's wrong? Nothing. You and Cloud get inside quick. But I... Hey, don't worry about a thing. I ain't about to die that easily. Okay, here I go. Watch this. Sid, go, 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 go! Dragon! It's weapon! Of all the times to show up. Okay, then come on, you. We're gonna fight weapon? Oh my god. die oh you trying to escape just a little war and I would have beaten him well at least the live streams back to normal damn you gotta be kidding this is bad the mainstream is kicking up something way bigger than that last one is on its way but what about Tifa and cloud don't have time to worry about anyone other than yourself don't know when that stream will blow Whoa! There's no time, hurry! Tifa Cloud, get out of here! Oh god, the tremors are getting worse! Doctor, shouldn't we move him somewhere? Hmm, it might be safer to move to an open area. Don't you worry about a thing, Cloud. I'll see to it that you get somewhere safe. Oh, look at him. Whoa! No! No! Oh my god! Cloud is in his chair! Oh my god! No! Please survive! Please survive! Please survive! Please survive! Please survive! Tifa? Well, where am I? What's happening? I... Where's Cloud? Cloud, where are you? Huh? What? Who? Who is it? I can't hear. Wait a minute. I know nothing about that. No, it's not me. I'd never do anything like that. Oh? No, stop it. Stay back. Somebody help, please. Oh, Tifa. Cloud, help me. Ah! Oh my god, what is happening with Tifa? Hey, yo! Where am I? Cloud? What is it, Cloud? What is this? Is this the inside of your dreams? Or is it your subconscious? You're searching, aren't you, Cloud? Searching for yourself. I can help too. We'll work together to try and get the real you back. But where do we start? <gasps> this is crazy! Um, a sealed up secret. Wish. Tender feelings that no one can ever know. That starry night at the well, the promise we made then, what if that memory was all a lie? Oh, it was a lie though, wasn't it? it was... <laughs> the gates of Nibelheim. Five years ago, Sephiroth passed through these gates. And that's how it all started. It connects to Nibelheim? That's right. It's probably best to start from there. I think we're gonna go in Nibelheim, right? Or at least like subconscious Nibelheim. Let's go have a look, Cloud. I know it's not easy. I'll be here for you. Oh, I'm loving this. Okay, I like this. I like this. I like this a lot. This is a Nibbleheim you remember, right? It's the same as my Nibbleheim. That's why this is our Nibbleheim. Five years ago, two men from Soldier came. Sephiroth and a young, vibrant soldier. Can you tell me again what happened? How does it feel? Five years ago, I saw the real Sephiroth for the very first time. It's your first time back to your hometown in a long time, right? So how does it feel? I wouldn't know because I don't have a hometown. Um, how about your parents? So this is the great Sephiroth. But to tell the truth, I thought he was very cold. And there he goes dabbing again! <laughs> I remember a foreboding about him. Ooh, that's an interesting little... Ooh. 
No, Cloud. Because that's not Cloud. That was Zack we saw before, right? I've been hiding it for some time. Afraid that if I told you something terrible might happen. But I'm not going to hide anything anymore. You weren't here. Cloud did not come to Nibbleheim five years ago. <gasps> I waited, but Cloud never came. The two that were ordered here were Sephiroth and another person. All right, let's go. Ah, I see him, I see him, I see him. You mean that member of soldier who came with Sephiroth wasn't Cloud? Ah! There's nothing I can say. You must find the answer yourself. If you can't, then take your time, Cloud. Slowly. Little by little, okay? Poor Cloud, I just want to give Cloud a hug. That starry night of the well and our promises. What if the memory was just all a lie? Don't hurry, Cloud. Don't answer too quickly. Just keep checking all those small emotions and it will come back. Slowly, little by little. Oh, This is gonna be so sad, I know it. Try and remember, Cloud. I was wearing these clothes. That's you too. You were so small then. And cute. Oh no! Oh, the little teeth for Cloud. Oh no, but I love these two though. Together, I do. Sephiroth once said, Cloud made up his memories by listening to my stories. Did you imagine the sky? No, you remembered it. That night, the stars were gorgeous. It was just Cloud and I. We talked at the well. That's why I kept thinking you were the real Cloud. I still believe you're the Cloud from Nibbleheim. But you don't believe in yourself. These memories aren't enough. Cloud, what about your other memories? No, not memories. A memory is something that is consciously recalled, right? That's why sometimes it could be mistaken or wrong. It's different from a memory locked deep within your heart. That's why it must be a fake. If you could recall up that memory... That's it! What about some memory that has to do with me? If I say something, you can't remember it. But if you say something, and I remember it too, then we'll know it's a memory. Now that you mention it, why did you want to join such a soldier in the first place? I always thought it was a sudden decision. I was devastated. I wanted to be noticed. I thought if I got stronger, someone would notice. Someone to notice you? Who? You know who. You! That's who! Me? Why? Tifa, did you forget about those days? Look, I... I'm sorry, but what are you talking about? Oh my god, is that young Cloud? No, it's alright. You were having a hard time back then. You were so busy with your own things. It's only natural you don't remember me then. Then? It's important to me. I hate to say it, but it's a very important memory. Do you want to see it? Do you know where this window goes to, Tifa? Fine, I'll go. Oh god, what's gonna happen? <gasps> it's her room. My room? It was my first time there. Was it? Cloud's coming. Oh my god. You think he wants to come in? Was that the first day you came into my room? That's right. We lived next to each other. But I really didn't know you that well. I've known you since we were children. And always thought we were close. Now that you mention it. I don't recall you ever being in my room. Tifa always used to have our own group. You were all childish, laughing at every little stupid thing. But we were children then. I know. I was a stupid one. I really wanted to play with everyone. But you never let me in the group! Oh no, I'm gonna cry! Then later, I started thinking I was different. That I was different from those immature kids. That, then maybe, just maybe they would invite me in. I thought that might happen. So I hung around. I was so prejudiced and weak. That night, I asked Tifa to come out to the well. I thought to myself Tifa would never come, that she hated me. It was so sudden. I was a bit surprised. What happened on this day? Was it a special day? This was the day Tifa's mother, the day mom died. I want to see mom. I wonder if there's anything beyond that mountain. Mount Nibble is scary. Many people have died there. No one crosses that mountain alive. How about those that died? Did Mama pass through the mountains? I'm going. Oh, Tifa. Oh, Cloud, though, as well. Oh, my God, Cloud's there. Oh, Cloud, run. Run. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Uh, what the hell am I doing here? I don't remember the path I walked. Tifa missed her step. 
I ran to her, but didn't make it in time. We both fell off the cliff. Back then, I only scarred my knees, but... Why did you bring Tifa to a place like this? What the hell's the matter with you? What if she dies? Tifa was in a coma for seven days. We all thought she wouldn't make it. Only I could have saved her. I was so angry at myself for my weakness. Ever since then, I felt Tifa blamed me. I went out of control. I'd get into fights with anyone. That was the first time I heard about Sephiroth. I thought if I was strong like Sephiroth then... Oh my god. If I could just get stronger, then even Tifa would have to notice me. So that was it? Sorry, Cloud. If I'd only remembered more clearly what happened, I could have done something sooner. It's not your fault, Tifa. But I remember back when we were eight. That's it. Now I know. You weren't created five years ago. My childhood memories weren't all made up. Hang in there, Cloud. Just a little longer. You've almost found the real you. Let's go back to Nibbleheim again. Oh my god, this is so crazy. The truth is right there. We almost have the answer right in the palm of our hands. To the reactor. The Marco reactor of five years ago. Oh my god, just in this scene. Because he sliced her. I remember now. <gasps> hey, it's Cloud. Zack. Zack. You remembered. That's right. It was Zack who came to Nibbleheim with Sephiroth. Then... Where were you, Cloud? Cloud, did you see it at all? Oh my god. Ah! Uh, what? I saw everything? What? What? Ah, who are you? Mom, Tifa, my town. Give it back! This is Cloud? I had so much respect for you. I admired you. W what? Just stabbed Sephiroth? Cloud? <gasps> so wait! Wait! What? You were there. You were watching me. Yeah, I remember. Hmm, so it was you. I feel like I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna cry. <laughs> you never made it as a member of Soldier. I even left my hometown telling everyone I was gonna join, but <laughs> I was so embarrassed I didn't want to see anybody. Oh my god, he's so sweet. <laughs> How does it feel? It's your first time back to your hometown in a long time, right? Oh god. <laughs> I'm... You came. You kept your promise. So you really did come when I was in trouble. Sorry I didn't get there sooner. It's alright, Cloud. How are you alive, Sephiroth? Cloud, kill Sephiroth. Oh my god. Sephiroth! <gasps> Don't push it. It can't be. What? <gasps> what? Cloud? Damn! Cloud. And this is goodbye, Tifa. Until we meet again. Oh, Cloud, it's really you, isn't it? I'm gonna cry. No, I don't, don't want to cry. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this game! This game is crazy. This game is crazy. You stupid jerk. You had us all worried sick. Voice there. I see we're in the live stream, aren't we? Everyone's waiting. Let's go back, Cloud. Back to everyone. Goodbye!
fuck. <laughs> I love Cloud! <laughs> Barrett, you came back. I. Where is he? Don't worry about him. He's a tough one. Barrett, I. When I was in the live stream, I saw the real Cloud. I mean, I didn't really find him. Cloud, he found himself. Alright, I know. I shouldn't have doubted. But I can't win against you. You're some kind of lady. I'm sorry. I am so on that Cloud and Tifa ship after that. I am so, they, they are just actually breaking my heart. They're actually like perfect together. <laughs> so, oh my God, the scene is breaking me. Actually breaking me. Tifa, snap out of it. Tifa. Everyone, I'm sorry. I don't know what to say. Don't say anything, Cloud. All you've been doing is apologizing. I never was in Soldier. I made up that story about what happened five years ago. I left my village looking for glory, but never made it into soldier. I was so ashamed of being weak, and I heard the story from my friend Zach. So Cloud actually made it up then. And I created an illusion of myself, made up of what I had seen in my life. And I continued to play the charade as if it were true. Illusion, huh? Pretty damn strong for an illusion. Physically, I'm built like someone in Soldier. Hojo's plan to clone Sephiroth wasn't that difficult. It was just the same procedure they use when creating members of Soldier. You see, someone in Soldier isn't simply exposed to Mako energy. Their bodies are actually injected with Genova cells. For better or for worse, only the strong can enter Soldier. A combination of Genova cells, Sephiroth's strong will, and my own weakness are what created me. Everyone knew that. I'm cloud the master of my own illusionary world and i can't remain trapped in an illusion anymore i'm going to live my life without pretending you're sure messed up cloud that means he ain't no different from before by the way cloud what are you going to do now don't tell me you're going to leave the ship i'm the reason why meteor is falling towards us that's why i have to do everything in my power to fight this thing good then you're going to keep fighting to save the planet it's like you always told me about it oh oh you mean that what i don't understand there ain't no getting off this train! My cloud again! Yay! Oh! Cloud, I was, I was deeply moved by your story. I'm a really weak person, and so I can really understand how you feel, Cloud. No one knows when fighting will begin, but let's get ready. Ah! Cloud again! Listen, Cloud! We're right in the middle of the mission for the huge materia, right? I know this is kind of out of the blue, but Jinan has an underwater reactor. As far as I can see, that's the only one left. That's that, let's go. Oh my god, this game. This freaking game. Guys, I've had a wonderful, wonderful stream. A wonderful, wonderful stream. This has been such a beautiful, beautiful stream today. And really emotional as well. Be your heart, be your guiding key. Bye, everyone. I love you all. Go!